hello guys welcome to the market channel uh, in this video we'll be talking about how to take profit and set stop loss on bybit that is how to set a take profit and stop loss on bybit on your spot trade so before we continue if you have not subscribed to this channel and watching this video right now please kindly subscribe now for more content like this so in this video i'll be using gmt coin so i already i already have a gmt coin in my uh in my bybit account i just create this, this new account and i funded with 13 dollar so just for this video alone so uh all so like i said i'm using gmt coin so i bought gmt coin already and if you have not bought the coin or sorry if, if you have not bought the coin you want you to set your take profit and stop loss make sure you go to your uh, search button type in any coin you want to enter the trade enter the trade and then you can go ahead and set your take profit or stop loss so what i'm trying to say is that uh, you must have bought the coin before you can set the take profit or stop loss for the coin so that's what i'm trying to say so let's get started gmt so i'll start gmt i want to use gmt so on that gmt i have us perpetual and spot so this is a spot trade so if it's a future trade i'll use the first one usd perpetual but i'm using a spot trade so click on spot that second one so don't forget i want to set a take profit and stop loss so that means i want to sell the coin so click on sell so now once we get here uh click on the you might be on limit just click on the limit you see a drop down so click on conditioner so now the conditioner now let's assume that let's assume that when gmt reaches 2.5 dollar I want my GMT to take profit to take my profit because currently the price is 2.2 so whenever GMT reaches 2.5 dollar I don't want to be in this trade anymore I'm okay with the profit I don't want to go so the first price we have here just input 2.5 because that's what, I, that's what I want my price to be second one also input 2.5 also repeat the same price for both and then 100% if we are selling the whole 100% or you only want to take 50% just set it and then sell so you see your uh, order will be pending at 2.5 or at the price you set it so whenever the price of this coin reaches 2.5 dollar even when i'm not in the market it's going to automatically take the profit and give me back to usdt and let's assume you want it to be converted to btc so that means you'll be choosing a pair of the coin slash btc if you want it to be converted to eth you're choosing the p of the coin slash eth so it depends but i want it to be converted to usd back so that's why i'm choosing usd pair so that's for that so let's assume i want to set a stop loss so that is maybe when gmt is 2.0 i don't want to be in this trade anymore all i need to do is to go to conditioner again so change the price now to 2.0 so 2.0 again repeat the same price 100 percent then sell so once you sell so automatically it's going to be pending at that price whenever the price reaches 2.0 so it's going to stop you out and give you the remaining parts of your funds in usdt so uh that's all for that uh on buy bid there's a functionality that is missing which is oco one cancel your other where you can set both take profit and stop loss together but uh, it's not available on bybit so that means on spot trading on bybit spot trading on bybit you can only choose to set a, talk, a take profit or you choose to set a stop loss so you choose either of the two you can set both of them together so you can also use uh, like this condition you can also use a, a range of price to set a take profit and stop loss but for exact price this i'm taught you i want to set and if you want to close your trade immediately just use market execution so 100 percent and sell and immediately your trade will be closed example like this so 100 percent always make sure you have if you want to use market execution always make sure you don't have any open order maybe for a take profit or stop loss for that coin so just click 100 percent and sell so can you see everything is so so let's go ahead and check my balance now you see USDC so it has been converted back so that's all for that don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to like this video and share with your friends thank you very much
God bless you all.